So I found a new weapon um, the other day, and it is amazing. It is my favorite stat, and it's on the M1A Marksman Rifle. Uh, mine happens to be a first wave M1A, but it could roll on any Marksman Rifle. And the stat's called Balanced. And it reads, the weapon reaches max accuracy faster when shouldering. Takes uh, 1574 firearms and 1181 stamina, which is really easy to get. And it is absolutely amazing. Um, I don't have any other stats on this that are useful, but this, I would say, is the number one most important stat to have on an M1A after seeing what it does. Let me just show you here. Um, I am able to fire at this target, and the reticle does not open up. I can fire at pretty much max rate of fire. And if I take cover and increase my stability, it's really, really nice. Um, you can do some consecutive headshots with this pretty easily. I really, really enjoy this. And one of the other nice things about this is you do not need to spec a bunch of accuracy on your mods anymore. So what I did is I modded it with crit chance in the mag, crit chance on the muzzle, and I have crit chance headshot damage on the scope. I did go with stability crit chance for the muzzle, and initial bullet stability and stability for the grip. Um, this has made me crit way more often, especially when I'm pulsing, I crit a lot. And I can just dump headshots or body shots consistently. And it's more than doubled the DPS output of my other M1A. Let me just show you my other M1A, which actually has more accuracy um, because I had to put accuracy on the scope, on the muzzle. Actually, the muzzle has initial bullet stability. Um, but, um, on the grip and let me just show you the difference even though this has more accuracy you will notice oh it didn't get equipped you will notice that the bullet spread is crazy and you cannot fire it as fast as the rate of fire on this gun so between shots i have to space them out like this and if i don't the reticle opens up and the bullets go all over the place even if you aim down sights the weapon the reticle spreads, you just don't see it. So if you're aimed on sights and you just unload, you'll notice the bullets are going all over the place. And with the balanced perk, the bullets do not do that, which is really, really nice. I'm not the best aim, but if you are the best aim, you will really, really, really love this. Um, let me just show you here. Let's aim down sights as fast as I can, and the bullets go right where I'm telling them to go. Really, really awesome, really OP. I'd say it's the number one first priority stat to get on an M1A. Um, and then damage mods. I would, I think I would want to have this crit damage and headshot damage, or this armor burn headshot damage, or this armor burn and crit damage, or whatever. Two, two damage stats and balanced, and I would be one happy camper. Just so easy to get consecutive headshots with little to no accuracy pen penalty, if any. I don't even think there is any. The only issue is uh, the horizontal stability, which I believe I spec'd horizontal stability trying to eliminate that. Um, actually, I think I tested it, and adding horizontal stability did not help with the actual horizontal stability. Um, I tested it out, and actually the just the stability itself and initial bullet stability helped it more than more than the horizontal, which was strange. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys end up getting an M1A or any type of sniper rifle with that stat. It's also extremely OP on automatic rifles. So let me just show you this SOCOM SCAR L. This thing rolled um, balanced. It reaches max accuracy faster when shoulder and swift. Um, it's not the greatest weapon, but let me just show you what happens when you have balanced on it. Uh, this thing is a laser beam. Um, well, the reticle actually opened up there. Oh, there we go. I don't know why it opened up. Oh, there it goes. It does open up at the end of the mag because the mag is so long. But if you're doing bursts, it is quite a laser beam. Not as good as I remember it, but, um... Still pretty awesome. Yeah, that is the one. 
I could have sworn it didn't it didn't up at all, but it does. Not much. Wait. Now it didn't. Maybe the stat wasn't working. Because now it's not doing it. That was really weird. Let's try that again. I think something was bugged. This is how I remember it. Oh, it's starting to open up again. You know what I think it is? I'm getting too many headshots. Proccing one is none. And shooting so many times that it has time to open up. I think that's what's going on. It's not opening up at all there. That's really strange. I'm not quite sure what's causing that. But it's going and going. Oh, it's starting to open it up. Very strange, very peculiar. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe it is because of the uh, one is none causing it to shoot more bullets. One thing that I did notice is if you put a rate of fire magazine on an automatic version, it ruins that perk. Um, let me just show you. Let me just throw a rate of fire mag in really quick and show you what happens. It is not happy with a rate of fire mag. The reticle, it just can't keep up with how slow um, or how fast it needs to close back up. So don't recommend a rate of fire perk with an automatic rifle in the balance perk. Now, if it was balanced and accurate, maybe that would fix it and you could get away with a rate of fire one which would be nice but let me know what you guys think what other guns do you have with that i'm i'm curious what it would be like on a vector um if if it would turn my vector into a much more accurate hose um because the vector does have some crazy um spread on its bullets um i'm curious i'd, I'd like to just test out a vector or any of the smgs with an accurate or with a balanced roll and see what it does if you guys do have one let me know what do you guys think post it in the comments below and let me um, know what your favorite guns are to have it on. My, so far, my favorite is the M1A and would never use anything else other than an M1A with that stat. Enjoy.